hi guys this is satya and uh, welcome to this video in this video i'm going to show you application which is designed to solve the fault calculations in the transmission line so quickly uh, we have few functions over here you can uh, reset the data you can load the previous values or you can save the current results in the form of uh, images or as well as the matlab mat files all right here you will give the input data and you will here you will choose the type of the fault and accordingly it will show you the results so let's try uh, all right so positive sequence is 0 0.603 negative sequence is also let's keep it at 0 0.603 then 0 0.089 let's see okay here i have to then coming to the base kva let's say it's 11 kb and uh, base mva let's say it's uh, 50 all right so these are the input data now i'm going to select the three phase fault so as expected in the case of the three phase fault we will have a high current so the current value is in pu that is in per unit and coming to the voltage so there will be zero voltage because all three phases are short now so uh, we will have the values of the voltage like zero and the current values will be like this so these are in the phase of form okay phase a phase b and phase c and you will have these values in the pu form as well all right so you have the magnitude of pu over here and the real and pu values like this now let's select with the same values and let's say the fault is this time is line to ground all right so uh, it's a fault from line to ground so there will be a current all right a high current the voltage of a single line will be zero and the rest of the two lines will be having a uh, voltage so that in this case it's uh, one per unit for the two transmission lines and another and the faulty line is having the zero voltage accordingly you will see the results over here so phase a in this case is having the fault so that's why the values are zero rest uh, phase b and phase c are correct all right so now coming to the another fault which is line to line fault similar values and double line to ground fault all right now coming to these functions so you can save these values okay you need to give it a file name let's say i say it is test all right so all these values will be saved test.bat here all these values will be saved now you can recall all these values let me show you i'll reset these values then i'm going to load the file and here i have loaded the test file and we are we can see the results over here Alright, so thanks a lot for watching the video. Please do subscribe my channel. If you are looking for this model, please contact me in the description section. Have a great day.